know it got to go. Uh, I'm about to, about to blow. Uh, I'm about to start the show. Yeah. You try to knock me down. You try to take my crown. But look at me now. Yeah, look at me now. Yeah. You try to knock me down. But I got up somehow. Yeah, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Miss Naturally Mary here. And today we're doing another what I like to call fake it till you make it video. And if you've been following my channel for a while, you know that I'm on a natural hair growth journey. And unlike some naturals whose hair grows like weed, my hair grows very slow. And I'm sure many of you all can relate. Leave a comment down in the comment section. I feel like some girls, their hair grows in two years what mine would take probably 20. <laughs> so in the meantime, in between time, I've been showing you all a number of different ways to achieve the same long natural hair looks that we desire for our gold length and thickness without having to wait so long to achieve our natural hair goals. So this unit is my new signature unit. It's called the Glory Crown Unit. I've shown you guys this particular unit in the coily texture, but now Her Given Hair has released the kinky coily texture. And I'm sure many of you all have multiple textures in your head like me. And y'all, this one is the best of both worlds. You have your kinky and the coily. And y'all, it's so, so beautiful. And it's gonna create a really natural look. It's going to create that look that you know we like, that looks like it grew out of your scalp. This is a U-part style unit and it's one of my favorites. Now this unit comes in two different lengths. It comes in length 16 and length 18. I have mine in length 18 and it isn't a natural color. I usually get mine in color 1B and I wish I had because I recently dyed my hair black, but I would just have to dye the unit on my own. So now we're going to co-wash the unit. Right at the package, the curls look amazing, but y'all know I like to do find the curls. So I'm going to be using the Aussie 7 in 1 conditioner and I'm actually showing you all the complete process this time. So underwater I like to saturate the hair first and then I apply my conditioner and then I begin detangling the hair with my Felicia Leatherwood brush and defining the curls. Wake up and listen to my anthem. Tune out the noises from my past and look up remember where my help comes from yeah I'm going to show you all the next step with the unit in a moment but I did want to show you guys that I did use aloe vera this time in order to enhance or promote hair growth and I will do another video if you guys desire that showing how I use aloe vera in order to grow my hair so you all let me know if you want to see that down below but this is what my hair looks like after fully washing it and everything the shrinkage is real but my hair is so healthy so shiny and so beautiful I do have type 4 natural hair and I feel like I do have a mix of two different textures so the unit that I'm going to be showing you all today is going to blend so perfectly with my hair so after I wash my hair I like to put on a microfiber bond in order to squeeze out any of the excess water so my hair is not dripping wet and this material is so much better because it helps to reduce breakage so now I'm going to show you all my natural hair prep for the U-part wig I start by spraying on a leave-in conditioner whenever I wash my hair and then I'm going to apply some moisturizing products and I will link the products that I use on my natural hair down below in the description box for this install I wanted to do a middle part so I'm going to start by parting my hair off down the middle and I'm also going to take out leave out along both areas of the part and this one does require a bit more leave out than my last thin part wig unit also be sure to take out a little hair behind the part as well that's going to help to conceal the back of the u part in addition to that i'm going to take out leave out along my edges you don't necessarily have to do that but i like to do that after doing that i'm going to moisturize my hair in the back braid it up pin it and then i'm going to begin to work on my leave out push back i'm tired of feeling broken truth rings louder than emotion Take time, remember what it means to love, yeah. Here's another chance to see the change we need. See a miracle when we walk these streets. Living life in the light, redefining the land of the fray. I can feel All 
All right, so this is what the inside construction of the unit looks like. There are two combs along the part and there are also combs in the back and along the side. So I'm just gonna insert the combs and position the unit where it needs to be to install it without any definition or anything, just so that you all can see what it looks like that way. And as you will notice, my hair is darker than the unit. The natural color has more of a brown tone to it. Once again, I recently dyed my hair black, so I will also have to dye the unit later on. But this is just a really good view of what the unit looks like in comparison to darker hair. So I'd recommend going with 1B or just dyeing it yourself. But the texture match though, my hair blends so well with this unit. I cannot wait to see the finished results. But right now I'm going to show you guys how I prep my leave out. So let's get to it. So I'm going to begin by applying the curl defining glaze to my hair first. And then I'm going to follow it up with the eco styler gel. And I will be flat twisting my leave out this time. After doing that, I'm going to extend my twist and I'm going to pull them back into my stocking cap. Allow those to set overnight. And then we're going to begin prepping the unit. And I am going to do a twist out y'all it's gonna be so bob testing one two three here i go give me that microphone <laughs> So now that we finished the leave out, I'm gonna begin prepping the unit. So I'm gonna install the unit once again and begin applying my two stylers. And I like to use both the coconut curling cream as well as the curl defining glaze on the hair. And then I'm gonna twist it up. I am later gonna add some perm rods to the end, but you all will see that in a moment. I'm pulling out my heart and soul and feel it deep down in my bones. It's my time to shine, I'm going far. Turn up that kick drum, funk that bass, drop and hit those 808s. Tonight I'm gonna light up like the stars. Hello, testing one, two, three. I'ma give my sight to see. Buckle on up and get ready. Hello, testing one, two, three. All is on me, make it loud. Listen up, can you hear me now? Give me that. All right, y'all. So later on that night, I decided to add yellow perm rod to the end of the hair. You could have let it set that way, but I really wanted a curl on the end. So I'm just going to add some perm rods, allow my leave out as well as the unit to dry probably a day or so. And then I'm going to come back and take the twist down. In order to ensure that the hair fully dries, I wouldn't recommend taking down the hair the next day. I gave it an additional day. And then the following day, I decided to take it down as well as my leave out. And it turned out so, so well.
really quick, I do want to share that I did add some temporary spray dye onto the hair so that it blends with mine. So I found this on Amazon. I sprayed this temporary hair dye along the top of the unit, not on the ends, but I did this the night before, allowed it to dry, and now we're going to get back to the takedown. Everything been moving fast, yeah. So I turn my foot off the gas, yeah. I just been looking around, I'm trying to see where we at, yeah, yeah, uh. Cause I see them all in the stands, yeah. I see them showing me love, I feel like it's part of the plan, yeah. Blessings all around me now, yeah. Even when it's looking down, I got a reason I can smile, uh. Y'all had it from the jump, yeah. Way back to the front, gave me what I need, never what I want. Cause I got enough, yeah. Yeah, I got enough, and I'm grateful for the chance. Got my wife and my family. Got a couple fans on the gram, understand me? I ain't never did it for the bands or the Grammys, but Cause I just know somebody need a plan, bitch. I've been down, I've been up, all around, all at once. But now I know just what I want. Cause I know I got enough, yeah I got everything, yeah Cause I got everything I got everything, yeah And then 
and I'm giving you the vibes, yeah. Shout out to the homie shop, cause we coming through with the try, yeah. We've been on the come up on the ground like how we overcame all of the odds, yeah. I gotta say that I'm grateful, you never know where I can take you. A wise man told me make the money, just don't never let the money make you. Life is all about the give and take and try and give away, I never break through. And everybody in the day one, so I celebrate on my day two, yeah. All right, y'all, these are the finished results. This turned out so, so well. This is my best twist out ever. It looks so, so good. This looks like it could be my hair. Well, that's the end of this tutorial. I hope you all thoroughly enjoyed the step-by-step -step video on how to create a really natural look. We gotta fake it till we make it, y'all. I love you guys. Be sure to leave your comments and feedback down below. Check the description for all the links and specifications to my new signature unit. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram if you aren't already. I love you guys, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye guys. Yeah. Yeah, I was born